Hey guys, it's your girl back at the Dollar Tree. I'll have to add the first video and then put this as part two. This is the second Dollar Tree I'm going to. Um, put that down. My son is going through my coupon pouch. <sighs> Hold on. Can you please stop going through my stuff? And stop grabbing things. Let go of it. So, we're going to get some tissues and a Jimmy Dean product. Sorry for the camera quality right now. Trying to do it all single-handedly, guys. Sorry. transaction with these coupons um, just to see if they work uh, we need a Jimmy Dean product and it doesn't look like they have a whole lot so we're just gonna get what they have because I could always use these my son will eat these these are Jimmy Dean and I'm gonna save 55 cents off of them and then I'm gonna go get four packages of Scotty's tissues and we're gonna save some money on those um, they might be down here. I might just get them off the end cap. So, just kind of scrolling through the aisles here. Okay, they're here. Okay, so there's 148 count. Compared to the little boxes I got last time, which was 64 count. So, we're going to get four of these. Just to make sure they work here and they override them. four in my cart and let's go check out guys and see if this works I might get something to drink while I'm here I don't know yet if they have coffee drinks in the fridge actually they might have that back there so let's go look back here real quick or I might get a chocolate milk he loves being pushed through the aisles like this I'm not sure why but it actually keeps him calm everything but what I want to drink. Baby, we're gonna find some chocolate milk to share. Or something good. I know, all the toys, huh? You've got lots of toys at home. We just got you a pair of socks at the other Dollar General. Stop touching them. We're gonna look for something to drink. Hold on, we're looking. That's all soda. Hold on! My mom is not letting you have that. And that's all soda too. So let's go to the aisle with juice. Will you calm down? We're at the store. I'm gonna park you right here and you're not gonna touch anything, okay? I don't think you can reach anyways. Maybe this? This is like the first thing I walked in on. Just looking at the date, guys. I'm not sure if it'll be good hot or what. Okay. We are going to try to go and get this. Um, here, let's go try this transaction. Because I've been here way too long and my husband's probably freaking out. Okay. There's beautiful for your darling faces. He doesn't quite understand yet. So we are going to see. Come to 
is six twenty six. All right, and I have these. Thank you. Yeah, those usually have to be overrid. Because they qualify for just for some reason they won't ring up right. And, and that's and they always forget to put coupons in our system as well. But yeah, I gotcha. Sorry, I didn't mean to cut you off either. Oh, you're perfectly fine. I was done saying something anyways. Yeah, we got a juice. It's in the bag. Oh, you're perfectly fine. High five. Son, what are you doing? I'm just going to get this oh. <laughs> it's not. It's just not working out. So I'm just going to explain what happened here. So basically, um, my Scotty's coupon, which is a tissue coupon, for some odd reason did not ring out. She ended up having to manually override it, which I'm not sure if she took the full amount off, which makes me kind of upset, but I still got a discount on it, and I still got it for like the price that I want it. Um, but the Scotty's tissue coupons for 75 cents off two definitely qualifies for the tissues here. I'm not sure why they don't take it off. I'm not sure um, why they won't work. She said that at the, towards the end that sometimes they don't put the system coupons in the system. So that could be why, but I'm not entirely sure. But this is part two. So I'm going to post the first video. And if you haven't seen the first video, go see that one. But this is part two to it. Um, the first one was an absolute fail. I did offer to put the tissues back that I got that was in my cart. And he said, no, we have a return basket. And that's where we put things. And I said, well, I'm offering to return it and like put it back where it goes. And he said, no, it's all right. And I, I just kind of went along with it. Like I always ask more than once to make sure because I did grab a lot of tissues expecting it. But their policy was they could not accept it if it did not go through in the system. And I thought that was kind of weird. But I did respect their policy and I did tell him that I'll go to another Dollar Tree, it's okay, I'm not worried about it. And he did apologize for not being able to accept the coupons. So, nothing wrong with that, it's not his fault, it's not anybody's fault, it's just their policy. Um, I will be looking into it further to see if that's why, because the manager there has accepted my coupons before. Um, there's a difference between policy and rules and regulations um, where your manager restricts certain coupons. Um, that's different, but that is still a thing. Like, they can still restrict the use of coupons depending on how bad it is and how bad couponers misuse the coupons, which none of these I've misused. The Scotties definitely qualify, so I'm not sure why Dollar Tree just probably didn't put them in the system because that's, like, they're a dollar a piece, so... But peace out, guys. I got to drive and go home. So I'll talk to you guys later. Bye.